Hi there, CJ Jenkins from Century 21 Cornerstone at Lake of the Pines in Auburn, California. Now our show for you today is being filmed on Wednesday night. Why is it being filmed on Wednesday night? I know you are asking that question. Well, it's because on Wednesday nights, I play bocce ball. And we have a very successful bocce ball league here at Lake of the Pines. We missed it last year during COVID, and I think it's been going on for seven or eight years now. As of today, we have 750 people playing bocce ball on these two courts right here. Now you might say, how do we fit 750 people on just two courts? And the reason is, is because we have league play. We have the Sunday people, 13 teams playing against each other. We have Monday nights, Tuesday nights, Wednesday nights, Thursday nights, and Friday nights. So for six nights, we have people here playing bocce ball. So on the Wednesday night, my team plays against the other 12 teams. There are 13 teams on Wednesday night. How much does it cost to play bocce ball? I know you're wondering, but it is so simple. We are playing for three months. Wednesday nights for three months, and it costs everyone who's playing individually $20. Go figure, $20? That's a great price, about a dollar a game for each person. Now these facilities here are all designed to be available to people at Lake of the Pines. The association has built these courts, uh, the, the tables, uh, the, the sun cover right there. We have a sun cover for when we have lasting sun. And so the um, association has this as one of the amenities at Lake of the Pines. Now, if you're not signed up for a league and you've just moved here, or you have family visiting on the weekend, what you can do is you can take your driver's license and drop it off at the bar. And the bar is right up there in the sports lounge. And you give your driver's license to the bartender. And in exchange, they will give you a bag of bocce balls. So you and your family can come and play bocce ball together. Now there is a schedule that's set up and so you would want to make sure that you check the schedule for the availability and sign your family up for that. Now what is so beautiful about bocce ball is it's a multi-generational sport. We can have 18 year olds play against, well someone on our team is 93 years old. We have some people who are older that might be in a wheelchair, they get up, put their throw in and sit back down. So, how do you play bocce ball? It's pretty simple. I learned a lot by watching Mr. Google and YouTube videos. And this game came from Italy. It's one of the three most popular games in America today. You don't have to be super fit to throw the bocce ball. So what you'll be doing here, if you watch John, is he is going to be throwing the bocce and his goal is to get the bocce ball as close as possible to the polino. The polino is the little tiny white ball. And how we know who throws next is the team that's closest to the polino doesn't throw. It's the team that's farthest away from the polino throws. And so we take turns in different frames at different ends of the court. But I'm going to stop right now and let Leanne in a few minutes film us when we're actually uh, playing the game because I need to warm up. And I will join you in a few minutes after our game starts. Thank you so much for being part of Lake of the Pines Living Facebook. And we hope you enjoy the story about bocce ball at Lake of the Pines. Stay tuned. Warm up. <laughs> that doesn't work. That's going to come back down. Good throw. Save it. Save it. Mark! 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 Ooh, nice.
Nicely done. And did you guys plan like when you go to work you like we didn't even that's call. Call. the shirt and like, she does the shorts today. Yeah, I mean, we just, it, it, just always, happens. it happens. It totally happens. Oh yeah. Do I cook too? Yeah, your assistant too since they're limited. No, it's wide open. Cleaning. Nothing but trouble. Mailing. Have to go to that end now. Oh. So why did you introduce oh, yourself right. like that? Why? I'm Say nothing but trouble. I'm nothing but trouble. Hi, I'm Joe. It was something like that. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Misinterpretation, but that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> nothing but joy. I think he said, didn't he? No. I think he did. Yeah, he said he you're here. He knows. <laughs> This is this friendly, friendly banter before game when it gets serious. Those are fancy ones. What? Hi, John. Hi, Oh, yeah. Hi, CJ. Hi. How are you? Wait, wait, wait. Fantastic. Oh, my God. Hi, CJ. Is he on your team? Yes. Oh. Edit, edit, delete, edit, delete. He's our personal smart ass. Oh, okay. You do have editing capabilities. Oh, yes, yes, yeah. I did that I would not have liked him in my classroom in middle school. Well, actually, I would have adored him, but I wouldn't let him know. Oh, nice one. Knowing him as an adult doesn't necessarily represent what he would have been as a kid. Could have been worse. Well, my son my son was one of those kids that actually was really funny. And every time he'd do a joke, I just wouldn't laugh at it because I didn't want to entice him. You know. Jerry used to get in trouble when he was in school because he was always smiling and laughing. It's totally funny. It's not funny. I'm yelling at you. That's the time to go get Yeah. Is it time? Yeah, we've already tried to get it. You've got two minutes. Go back. Two minutes to practice. I gotta get your form, it's so beautiful. <laughs> oh, it didn't even go over. Oh, yes, it did. And what's your team guy's name again? <laughs> We're uh, Carpe Bocce. Oh, Carpe Bocce. Too strong. Too strong. Hannah's deadly. Hannah or Hannah? Are you filming? Hannah. Yeah. Did you wait till the game? Oh, no, this is just, I can cut this out. I'm just doing this for fun. That's right, Sam. Very good, Sam. You're good. I don't know. Hard to poop. That one did a little curve. <laughs> you are good, though. You got it. Was that your second one, CJ? Did no, I throw? My okay. Couldn't remember how many I threw. <laughs> No, it was my second. Oh, was no, it was sure. No, it was I can't my, remember. I, th I think ahead, it was. Okay. Go ahead and roll. I tapped out. <laughs> Whatever happens, happens. Oh, this one. Ooh. We got a little breeze going today, too. <laughs> oh, ooh. there's some strength in that one. Ooh. Now, see how he's moved it to the green ball? That's where we give him a little hug. Oh. Okay. Yeah, mine was still closer. <laughs> his was, his still, yeah, it looked like it was still closer. But you closer. give me a hug anyhow. <laughs> I think he still had it, but it was a nice gesture on his part. <laughs> we would have been good. Hi, guys. Back again. CJ Jenkins with you at Lake of the Pines Living Facebook. Well, we just showed you part of our bocce ball game. You got to see the bocce ball courts and see the fellowship that is going on during a bocce ball game. Uh, you're friends with the people that you're playing against. There's lots of laughter. Um, we just have a great time with meeting other people and just the sense of community where everybody can throw a bocce ball. So if you would like any more uh, questions or if you have questions about bocce ball at Lake of the Pines or any of the activities that we have with our amenities at Lake of the Pines, give me a call. Call CJ at 530-906-4715. Call CJ 
and I'd be happy to answer any questions that you have. We're very excited, by the way, we've got a new park being built right now, Hazel Park. It's going to have five pickleball courts, a sand pit volleyball court, a full basketball court, a launch site into Hazel Pond, and lots going on in that park. So as soon as that gets farther along, we'll highlight that for you. On another note, this is our Lake of the Pines newspaper. This newspaper gets sent to anybody who owns a home at Lake of the Pines. If by chance you would like a copy of this newspaper and you don't live in the community yet, you want to check out what's happening, what are some of the events happening this particular month, this happens to be the month of July, then uh, if you'd be interested in getting a copy of the Lake of the Pines newspaper, please call CJ at 530-906-4715 and I'd be very happy to put one and post it to you, send it to you in the mail, and you would be able to know a lot more things about the community that you can decide to move to. And hopefully we will see you in the future on the bocce ball court at Lake of the Pines in Auburn, California. Thank you so much and enjoy your summer.